بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ہر ایک ذرے میں ہے شاید مکین دل اسی جلوت میں ہے خلوت نشین دل اسیر دوش و فردہ ہے و لیکن غلام گردش دورہ نہیں دل سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ فرام ہیئر ہر ایک ذرے میں ہے شاید مکین دل سو وی ہیومن بینگس یو نو وی ہیو فزیکل باڈیز اوکے and then we have an you can say unphysical part as well inside us so you can call it ruh you can call it spirit or you can um, call it essence okay so we basically have an inner essence you know within us and we all have it and this essence is basically on the image of creator or you can say it's the same essence okay so that's why when we say that all human beings are connected so that's what it means you know so we are connected in our essence you know um, and even the you know the physical bodies you know 99.9% genetic makeup is the same so and then we are human beings and then we have other living beings around so we have a definition of living and non living so all other living beings uh, you know they also have this inner essence and it is the same essence you know it's one essence and then there are non livings okay uh, you know the that we define them non livings but ikbal what ikbal is saying here that har ek zarre mein hai shayad makinil that everything like when we look outside so whatever we see basically we call it matter okay so matter is made up of tiny little particles and you know so those particles are you know if you're a chemist or a physicist you know so your definition uh the names of those particles will be will change but basically we matter has a particle nature okay so the smaller and smaller particles so what ikbal is saying that each particle has its own essence you know so that means every particle is kind of living being and then they have a, they have an essence you know so essence is what makes uh, you know us a living being you know so every particle has a, its own essence so isi jalwat mein hai khalwat nasheen dil so then you can imagine this whole matter's dimension so basically it's like a big a big town or city you know you can call this whole matter's dimension the whole universe that we can see and inside each particle you know there is this little essence you know that lives within uh, every single entity every single particle like curled up and within that essence so now this dimension matter's dimension is it you know it has its own laws physical laws okay so every object like you know sun, earth revolves around sun and then this whole solar system you know is in a galaxy and then there is a galactic center and then the solar system revolves around that galactic center so there is motion you know there is this circular motion and that there is this constant expansion of the universe so so all the objects and all those particles are in this motion and if particles are in this motion that means the essence that we have within us it's also under the under this motion you know under the same pattern and then we see uh you know so there is time as well and we have future and past and you know uh now so what is that so it's basically our uh, you know the way uh, earth revolves around sun so that gives us day and night okay and that's when we say oh you know past day and uh, future you know the, the next day and today so you know so it comes from this motion so uh we all you know the in matter's dimension every object is you know a sire dosh farda you know it's it is under you know is this uh, the spell of dosh farda uh and similarly our essence follows this same trajectory same path but gulam e gardish e daura nahi dil that it it is true that essence also follows the trajectory of physical bodies but this essence does not become slave of this gulam e gardish the the time you know the the motion that we have on this earth and the movement of time you know the way time passes so essence does not become slave of uh, this motion you know gardish e daura so and but we human beings become slave 
of of this you know we repeat things and then we become slave of those repetitions you know we cannot come out of those um, those repetitions so we become slave of this day and night we can't think uh, beyond you know so we are kind of trapped in this dimension uh, but then we forget about this essence you know the, the true essence the true nature of us because the true nature of us it's not from this dimension you know it's from somewhere else and those laws are different laws you know so our job is to free ourselves from this dimensions you know uh basically you know the the spell that this dimension has casted on us so we have to free ourselves you know Although we have to live, you know, so essence live within us and then it does the same thing. It follows the same path and trajectories. So we have to do the same, you know, we'll, we'll still be living in this day and night stuff. But you, we free our self, you know, inner self and then we connect it to something uh, big, you know, another dimension, inshallah. And